Good morning, everybody. It is Brett here at Summit Auto. We're gonna do the Monday morning lot walk. Got some vehicles in over the weekend, not a ton, but a uh, couple trucks, couple SUVs, and we got a couple left over from uh, last week there that we didn't quite get to. Um, so we'll go over all those. As always, these vehicles are gonna be listed in the description below with links to our website so you can get miles, options, all that good stuff on there, and we'll be getting pictures up of these as soon as possible. And if you ever want to see anything in these videos, you want me to show the interiors more, you want me to point out stuff that we're going to be fixing uh, better, let me know. I can cater these to however you guys want. And uh, got a pretty good viewership on the last video, almost 250 views for that lot walk, so that was pretty good. Anyways, let's get right into it, and I uh, hope your month is going well. We're, uh, we're pacing pretty well here, so we're going to keep it rolling with these new incoming vehicles. Okay, so this one is one we did last week. This is a 15 Ram 2500 Laramie, 83,000 miles gasser. Uh, pretty nice truck. It's got some dings on it and stuff. But other than that, a really nice condition for 83,000 miles. And we're going to get that in uh, next here. So this is a 2018 Ram 2500 SLT. And uh, you can see the hood's open because... We went to go clean it and for whatever reason the windshield wipers do not turn off so we had to disconnect the battery and we're going to be putting that into service without pictures because um can't really do pictures when the windshield wipers are going crazy anyways uh here is an equinox we just took this in on trade this is a 2019 premiere so it's loaded up it's got leather um brown and black leather seats got the touchscreen radio the uh, sunroof actually the Vista roof in here and uh, that's a really nice vehicle that one has 35,000 miles it is in all-wheel drive now we got some dings on there that we got to fix and uh, that's really the only thing I saw maybe a couple little spots to buff right here is a 2020 Jeep Wrangler Sport this is a pretty much the most base model you could get no power windows no power locks and automatic the only option it really has is backup camera it has the soft top and uh, yeah but it's in really nice condition it has 42,000 miles it is not a Willis package somebody put those stickers on there so I'm gonna take those off so nobody gets confused but overall it's in really nice condition for 42,000 miles uh, pretty much perfect and uh, that'll be getting in today soon this is a 2014 f450 so this is a lariat ultimate it has nav moon uh, heated cooled seats i think it's got no probably just heated seats no heated and cooled seats it's loaded up it's in pretty nice condition it's got a couple little things that we're gonna have to take care of um mainly and stuff like this happens from time to time. I was uh, checking out the exhaust tip to see if it was chrome or not. And it's kind of just hanging there. And I found out that it's missing a pipe under here. So a pipe that goes from there to uh, there. So I will have to put it, that on my notes for service to look at. It just needs a pipe. There's not, not a filter or anything. So should be a pretty easy fix but other than that it's in pretty nice condition and this one has 69,000 miles it's got the fx4 package really clean inside uh, just needs a little bit of love on the outside and that exhaust pipe this here is a 2022 ram bighorn level one however it does have the leather catskin seats it's got brand new tires on it and other than a couple little dings in the box here and we got to probably buff the box it's in really nice shape it comes with the fifth wheel and gooseneck prep package and spray and bed liner and like i said brand new tires so it's it's a really nice truck and optioned out nicely up there is a ram 1500 bighorn we did that one last week as well uh, that's going to be one of the next ones we get in here this morning that one's got 67,000 miles really a nice trade-in uh, nice condition couple little dings on it, but Dent guy loves me or he hates me because I give him too much work um, 
This is a 2018 Toyota Highlander limited all-wheel drive. Green in color. It's got green metallic. It's really a cool color. Check that out in the sunlight. I've got a couple dings in the door. Once again, dent guy loves me. Anyways, really a nice ride, really clean inside. This one has 61,000 miles on it, and uh, that should be a very nice inventory piece. We have a 2018 Ford Explorer that came in trade. This is a Sport. It's got the EcoBoost four-wheel drive. We've got to do tires on it. Uh, ruby red is the color on this one. It has the LED headlamps, LED fog lamps. It's in really nice condition. A lot of times you see these Explorers and the hoods will be corroded and stuff. This one's in really nice condition. They probably had it warrantied. Um, but 80,000 miles on this one. And uh, yeah, that'll be a nice SUV piece too. This is a 7,000 mile Ram 2500 Crew Cab Short Box Laramie Night Edition. 7,000 miles this thing's just came in, literally just brought it over. And uh, it's really nice, 20 inch wheels. It has a bed mat. I'm guessing it has the fifth wheel gooseneck prep package because it's got all the wiring over there. And uh, really nice condition, LED tail lamps. And then this is a 2018 Chevy Silverado 2500 Crew Short. This one has 46,000 miles on it, I want to say. It's got some aftermarket wheels. This is from Oregon. Got this one from Oregon, just came in. And you can see it brought some Oregon with it. I think Jimmy Buffett had a song, Take the Weather With You. Well, this person took the, uh, this truck took the land with it. Anyways, we'll pressure wash that, get that off. That's not a big deal. And I just want to make sure miles on here. Yep, 46,000 miles. Yeah, it's low on washer fluid, needs an oil change, but 46,000 miles. Runs really nice. You get uh, heated leather seats. I'm guessing this is a LT1 with leather, but a pretty nice truck. Z71, Duramax, it's going to be the L5P engine with uh, 445 horsepower. Here is a Dodge Durango, this is a 2021 GT Plus all-wheel drive, this one has 27,000 miles on it, it's got the uh, SRT hood on it, it looks good, really nice shape, 27,000 miles, I didn't see anything glaringly obvious on this one so that'll be a nice piece so just took that in trade on Saturday and then this is a Ram Promaster this is a 2019 Ram 3500 high roof uh, probably the longest wheelbase that you can get I don't know was that 172 not great on my Promaster knowledge but this thing's really cool it's got a bunch of stuff in it Got a bunch of shelves. And it's got like a toolbox. Yeah, it's really neat. It's uh, done up nicely inside, especially if you've got to do a bunch of work. Uh, this one has 40,000 miles on it, but if you need to put tools and stuff in here, definitely a nice setup for that. And that is the Lot, lot, lot Walk. This is a Wrangler just did a video on last week that's new. It's sold on Saturday. It's a cool package, it's a sport. This is an Overland we just got through for pictures. I'll be doing a video on that later today. And uh, that one's got 144,000 miles, can you believe? So this is after we run it through our process, clean them up, 144,000 miles. Uh, really nice condition on this one. That's gonna go fast once we get the video up. And that's the lot walk. Go to summitauto.com, we got pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle here and once again like I said if you want anything, anything special done in these videos I can go more in depth on what we're doing or what's what the process is uh, just uh, let me know in the comments below thanks for watching the video and remember to like subscribe and share on the YouTube channel 
and have a great day and finish out the month strong.